Welcome sa sip9.com. Uh, in this video, magsisimula tayo ng panibagong series, no? yung uh, operations on decimals. Uunahin natin yung addition on decimals. No? So, meron tayong um, several examples. For example, uh, 1.2 plus uh, 2.3. Paano yan? Paano natin yan ina -add? Now, ang pinaka-strategy is, of course, to uh, place the numbers in ve vertical form. No? So, uh, 1.2 plus, ang pinaka-general rule is to align the decimal points. No? So, dapat magka-align silang dalawa. So, ibig sabihin, dapat yung 2.3 natin na ganito. Okay? And then, pag naka-align na, you add the decimals and you add the whole numbers. So, 2 plus 3 is 5. Tapos, uh, 1 plus 2 is 3. Tapos, syempre, kukopihin natin yung decimal point na naka-align din siya doon sa, sa mga decimal points ng added natin. So, 1.2 plus 2.3 equals 3.5. Okay, so, let's have our second example. We have uh, 1.5 plus 0.3. So, ganun din. We have to align the decimal points. So, 1.5 plus 0.3. And then, add natin yung decimal. We have uh, 5 plus 3 is 8. And then, of course, 1 plus 0 is 1. Tapos, point. Pwede rin unahin nyo muna yung point, no? Para hindi, hindi kayo magkamali, no? Uh, gawin natin yan sa third example natin. Third example is... Uh, 2.25 plus 5.34. So, 2.25 plus 5.34. Ayan, naka-align siya, no? So, unahin natin yung decimal point. Dito natin lagay. Dapat magkatapat sila. And then, we have uh, 5 plus 4 is 9. 5 plus 4 equals 9. Tapos, meron pa tayong isa dito, 2 plus 3 equals 5. Tapos, yung whole number natin ay 7. So, 7.59. Okay? Uh, one more example. We have uh, 4.85 plus uh, 2.36. 2.36. So, 4.85 plus 2.36. Okay? So, makikita natin dito, may magkikerry tayo, no? magkikerry over tayo. So, we have 5 plus 6 equals 11, carry 1. So, pareho lang din. Para rin tayo nag-add ng uh, whole numbers. 1 plus 8 is 9, plus 3 is 12, carry 1. 1 plus 4 is 5, plus 2 is 7. So, that's 7.21. So, dito rin, dito rin yung decimal point yung nakatapat. So, this is 7. Point. Okay, so may mga pagkakataon na minsan hindi pare-pareho yung number of uh, decimal numbers natin. No? Dito kasi mga examples natin, dito may merong isang decimal, isa rin dito, ganun din dito, isa rin, isa rin. Dito dalawa-dalawa, and dito rin dalawa-dalawa. So may mga pagkakataon na um, meron tayong given na hindi, naka, hindi pareho yung number of decimal numbers nila. No? So for example, what is 9.12? 9.12 plus 5.2 for example. So, anong gagawin natin? Dito meron tayong dalawang decimal numbers. Dito meron tayong uh, isa. No? So, ganun din. Uh, just follow the rules. No? O, yung una natin sinabi na rule na we have to align the decimal point. 5.12 tapos oh, not 5.12 but 9.12 9.12 plus 5.2. Tapos, yan. So, walang katapat yung 2 dito, no? So, pwede na, actually, pwede natin yung lagyan ng 0, no? Ibig sabihin ng 5.20, wala siyang katapat kasi ito yung ating tenths, di ba? So, naalala nyo kung sa decimal numbers, this is the tenths, tenths place. This is the hundredths place. With H, no? Kasi pag whole number, hundreds place, tsaka tens place, walang, walang TH sa dulo. So, dito may TH ito kasi ibig sabihin decimal siya. 
So, dalawa dito, isa dito, yung sa original, but we can put zero here. Pwede naman hindi, no? Basta, basta siguraduhin nyo lang na mararemember nyo kung saan siya nakatapat. So, 2 plus 0 is 2, then 1 plus 2 is 3, and of course, we align the decimal point, and then 9 plus 5 is 40. Okay? So, yun lang, the pinaka-general rule is to align. Oh, align the decimal points. Okay, maraming salamat. Uh, I hope meron kayong natutunan. Meron pa tayong ano, no, uh, mga examples. May mga susunod pa tayong examples. And we will learn how to add uh, complicated uh, decimals o yung mas marami pang decimal places. Okay, so uh, gusto kayong invite sa sipnayan.com. Uh, yan yung ating website. And of course, you can uh, um, visit our uh, YouTube channel. Pwede kayong mag-subscribe para every time na may bago tayong video ay uh, makaka- o may inform kayo via email. No? Maraming salamat. See you in the next tutorial.